everyone! Today I'm going to show you how I made these cute little treat bags for my niece and nephew. So the first thing I started with um, was a 10 inch uh, plastic clear treat bags. I had some that already had uh, stickers on them from our uh, wedding labels actually. We had a candy table so I decided to um, reuse a few of the already labeled ones. But as you can see on the stickers on these bags, there is no white on them. And how I got rid of the white is I used a black uh, paint pen. So this is just the Craftsmart uh, paint pen in black. And you just shake it up and uh, a really dark, thick black uh, paint comes out to get rid of the white. So next on the inside of the black, I have a little punched out shape and a little pumpkin sticker with googly eyes. The paper punch that I used was the Martha Stewart one and I didn't want it to cut out the middle circle, I wanted the full one so I have it over onto this side. The orange polka dot paper came from uh, the Lawn Fawn set and that is the um, 6x6 Let's Polka in the Dark. And the one that I used was the small orange polka dot. And here it is there with those two punches. And for the stickers, I used a set I got last year. And it is from this set here. You can see they're almost gone. Uh, there's one left, one little pumpkin in there with googly eyes. So these are the Sandy Line stickers and they are called uh, Pumpkin Faces. Now to go with the orange polka dot theme, I used some uh, ribbon that I picked up from Michael's a little while ago in a sale. Um, if you haven't seen that craft haul, I'll link it down below. Uh, so this is the yellow Celebrate It. And they don't have specific color names, there's just that color number on the back there. Now I forgot to mention, I wanted uh, the orange paper to stick really well to that paint pen um, and so I used my Ranger uh, Multimedia Matte um, because it's a very, very strong adhesive. Now you also see some little um, cards there with uh, cats and pumpkins. Now these are um, repurposed cards, so when I receive cards, um, I don't throw them out after, I keep the fronts. and. Um, I cut these ones down using my paper cutter to make little tags for these gift bags. So I went ahead and punched a hole in the sides. I'm going to thread it onto the ribbon and tie a bow. And there we have those cute little cat tags on the front. Uh, so when they take them off, they'll see the little pumpkin underneath. Now I am going to put little labels on them with their names. Um, I may use that paint pen to write on the front, uh, but likely I'll just write on the back there a little Halloween message. So in the pack I have jelly beans, there's some fuzzy peaches, and a little wonder bar. So I kept everything in the Halloween colors. Oh, and then there's some sour pumpkins as well. Um, you can pick up all this stuff at Bulk Barn, um, and uh, I just picked up um, the Sour Patch Kids and the little chocolate bars in uh, packs at the grocery store. So I hope you enjoyed this uh, short little tutorial on Halloween bags. Um, have a safe and fun Halloween.